Should you file a cheap provisional patent application? In general, if the invention is a small money idea, one that you're trying to build into a side hustle only, then filing a cheap provisional patent application or even preparing one yourself without the help of an attorney may be suitable. The key is that it has to be a small money idea and one that won't make you a large sum of money. The high cost of hiring a patent attorney to prepare and file the application for you doesn't justify the potential small amount of money that you could make. Some in the licensing industry encourage others to prepare their own provisional patent application before they try to pitch their idea to others in order to give themselves what they call perceived ownership. If you want to try to write a patent application on your own, I've created a guide which you can use. You can find a link to the guide in the description below. Another reason that you should file a cheap provisional application is if you don't have the budget to hire a patent attorney. You have no other choice but to prepare one yourself. Having something on file is better than having nothing. However, if you have a big money idea, I do not recommend preparing your own patent application to save money. A big money idea is one that you're trying to build into a successful business and you're going to invest a large sum of money. In general, the vast majority of patent applications that I've reviewed, which were all self-prepared by the inventor, are woefully inadequate. They fail to include variations, options, and alternative embodiments. In many instances, they also fail to identify the point of novelty of the invention. Now, there is a third option. You can find a patent attorney to prepare a cheap provisional application for you. They'll charge you around $4,000. However, in my experience, when I transferred these types of cases into my firm, they suffer the same problems as those applications prepared by the inventors themselves. The reason is that they just don't have enough time to adequately work on the patent application. Their main goal is to get inventors to approve the application so that they can file and close the matter. And my firm, the cost of a provisional application is significantly more than $4,000. But the reason for that is that we preload the provisional application with the variations, options, and alternative embodiments. Plus, we include a full claim set and formal drawings. That way, the provisional application provides good patent pendency type patent protection. You can have confidence knowing that when you pitch your idea to others or market your product, your patent protection extends beyond just the point of novelty of your invention. Others can't file their own patent application and steal your idea. My name is James Yang. I'm a patent attorney, engineer, and author. I've been helping clients since 2004 protect their inventions and brands with patents and trademarks. I also wrote Navigating the Patent System to help inventors like you get through the patent process. After 400 granted patents and hundreds of registered trademarks, I'm confident that I can help you.